Former president of Patterson Auto, Anthony Patterson, was back in court this morning just days after his most recent arrest on new charges related to trafficking and sex crimes against children. Josh Hargard was there today. He joins us now with the very latest. Josh. Yeah, guys, this morning's hearing in the 78th District Courtroom addressed a motion filed by the state that would forbid Patterson from making any contact with persons under the age of 18 whatsoever, including family members. Both the prosecution and the defense called witnesses to the stand this morning, including Patterson's bond supervisor, who testified on Patterson's behalf that he has followed his bond conditions thus far and supervised visits with family members under the age of 18 has been permitted so far by the court. But during cross-examination by the prosecution, he testified that it would be possible for Patterson to commit another crime while he was being monitored. And ultimately, Judge Meredith Kennedy granted the state's motion this morning. Now, under his current bond condition, Patterson must remain in Wichita County unless he gets permission from the court to leave. He's also required to submit to GPS monitoring and to reside at his mother's home. However, if he becomes aware that a child or minor will be present at his mother's residence, he's required to vacate 24 hours prior. And another hearing on his bond conditions is set for June 1st. Now, after his most recent arrest on Monday, Patterson now faces 18 felony counts of trafficking and sex crimes against children. His jury trial is set to begin later this year on October 30th. If you want more details from today's hearing or if you've missed any of the recent updates, they're all on Texoma's homepage. Guys? Okay, Josh, thanks so much for that update.